Hello, good evening, Miss Jenny. Good evening, Carlos. Good evening, Maria Jamilet. Good evening, Julio. Welcome, welcome. Good evening. Good evening. How are you today? Oh, I'm good. Nice, Mister. Thank you for sharing. Good evening, Miss. Welcome. Are you oyente, Miss Maria Jamilet? Or no, it's just normal. Okay, I'm gonna put you here, oyente, okay? Mm, yesterday you said, ya me acuerdo que usted dijo ayer que iba a ser oyente today. Hello, welcome, Mr. Yes, Mr. Iba a decir algo, Mr. Hello, Miss Jenny. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you, Miss? Bye. Nice, Miss. Thank you for sharing. Okay, okay. So let's wait maybe uh, two more minutes for the other ones. Maybe they join. Vamos a esperar dos minutitos rapiditos, okay? Tal vez se unen los demás, okay? Oh, okay, Miss Maria Yamilet. Everybody has something to do today. Hello, Mr. Carlos Argueta. Welcome. Okay, you're oyente. Thank you. Okay, I think most of it are here. Because I don't know what happened to the other ones. I'm gonna send them one sticker like yesterday because what are they doing? Okay, so let's start. Hello, Miss Clelia. Welcome. Good evening. Okay, no problem, Mr. Carlos. Okay, let's go ahead and start today's class. And we are going with English for our program. This is basic model number three. Uh, and um, um, my name, one more time, is Lisa Rosmeyer Bral Martinez. Today, as you know, it is Tuesday, December 16th. I mean, 6, sorry. <laughs> 6, 2022. And today we are going to continue with unit number three, that is communication 
communication at the workplace, okay? So uh, today we are going to practice a little bit of uh, more, like these are words that are very important. Vamos a practicar estas palabritas que son muy importantes que ayer empezamos con dos. ¿Cuáles eran las palabritas de ayer? Vamos a ver who remembers. Could. Could and? Sure. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Good. Whoa. Good, exactly. Whoa. Could and would you mind and would you like, right? Those words and the words that we are going to study today are called modos. Las palabras del día de ayer, junto con las que vamos a estudiar el día de ahora, se llaman modos. Why? Okay, Mr. Juan, Ezequiel. ¿Por qué se llaman modos? Porque llevan otro verbo, ¿ok? Y expresan una situación, como el, por ejemplo la de ayer, expresaban eh, algo que ustedes deseaban o solicitaban algo, ¿verdad? Y today we are going to use should and should not y el día de ahora vamos a aprender con el should y el should not para hacer eh, o para decir situaciones que son apropiadas y inapropiadas en el trabajo. Inappropriate behavior at work. Okay, so we are going to start, but first I have this activity para iniciar. Tengo esta actividad in which one is called missing game. What are you going to see? You're going to look at the pictures. You're going to say what is missing. Van a ver unas imágenes y van a decir qué es lo que falta en estas imágenes. Let's start. This is the picture, the first one, okay? What is missing? ¿Qué es lo que, es, que falta? Over there. The students. The students? No. Mira esta imagen. First, is, this is the picture. What about this one? El mundo. The world. The world. <laughs> exactly. Very good. Excellent. It was missing the work. Okay, let's see next one. What is missing? Ruler. The ruler? Hmm. Yes, it's a ruler. And let's see, next one. What is missing? Um, television. Television? Yes, very good, excellent. What about this one? Backpack. 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 Yes, very good, it's a backpack. Excellent, what is missing here? Books. Let's see, yes, very good, excellent. How do you say basurera? Uh huh. It's trash can. Exactly. Trash can. Okay. Basurero. Trash can. What about this one? What is missing? The ball. Ball. Exactly. The ball is missing. Excellent. What about this one? What is missing? Rock. The what? The rock. Yes, the rock. Very good. Rock. What is missing? A laptop. Let's see. Computer. Yeah. Is the computer or the laptop? Very good. What is missing here? Okay. 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 The test. The test. Uh -huh. What is missing here? Bear. Teddy bear. Mm, the teddy bear. What about here? What is missing? The clock. Clock. The clock. Yes, the clock. Very good. What is missing here?
What is missing? Do you remember? Yes, but I know how do you say English in English? Stand up, please. No. Look over there. Mm -hmm. What is that? White. Uh -huh. Black. Okay, that is a white. Whiteboard. Uh, it could be a whiteboard. It can be the thing that you put in the projector. It would be like the, oh my goodness, the TV for the projector. Okay. Because it's like the, I forgot how to call it. What about this one? Yeah, it's the, the white thing. The bottle. Yes, the bottle. Very good. In here? Apple. Apple. Very good. The apple is missing. Look over there, the apple. What about this one? What is missing? Uh, the eraser. Eraser. Yes, the eraser. Very good. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Let's go with something else. And in this one, uh, we are going to practice a little bit. Uh, would you like uh, that? This is a topic that remember that yesterday we didn't study much. Si se recuerden, pues no hicimos mucho del would you like because we were practicing with your mind. Okay, but we are going to do it. Uh, welcome, Miss Blanca. Welcome, Ana Marlene. Welcome, Nilton, Edwin, Diana. Welcome, Adriana. Thank you for being here. Okay, so let's practice. Thank you, teacher. Nice. Welcome. Good evening. Okay, so this one, let's see. Okay, let's start. Would you like? ¿Se acuerdan de cómo vamos a contestar? Sure, that's right, in a minute, okay? Okay, let's start con los que no he escuchado. Vamos a ver. Let's start with Ana Marlene. Would you like to eat 100 hot dogs? Miss Ana Marlene, no te escucho, Miss. Oh, no te escucho, Miss. Okay, let's see. Blanca. Would you like to eat 100 hot dogs? ¿Cómo iba a responder ahí, teacher? Do you remember the answers from yesterday? Were you in class yesterday? ¿Te acuerdas de las respuestas? Ayer, eh, no, no pude entrar. Okay, so sure, or... Eh, Sorry, I can't. Uh -huh, exactly. Sorry, I can't. Exactly. That's another one. Or maybe in a minute. Or maybe, or I'm afraid I can't as well. Or you can say, I would. Yes, I would. Thank you. Yes, yeah, really? 100 hot dogs. Seeing hot dogs. Oh, my goodness, me. Yes. Oh, my goodness. That's Todo el día. <laughs> uh -huh, <it> totally. <laughs> <laughs> That's good, Miss. Thank you. Let's see next one. Mir, eh, Mr. Nilton, would you like to go shopping? Yes, sure. Oh, nice. Let's go, Mr. Where, Mr.? <laughs> Where are we going shopping? Multiplaza, Gran Vía, Galería, <laughs> Metro Centro. <laughs> Let's see next one. Um, it would be Julio, would you like to fall in love? I'm afraid I can't. Oh, that's great, Mr. Rick. <laughs> You're in love right now. <laughs> okay, let's see. Jenny, would you like to appear in a movie? Huh? Would you like to appear in a movie? ¿Te gustaría aparecer en una película? Yes, you. Oh, nice. <laughs> Very good. What about next one? Miss Diana, would you like to eat 
to be famous, Miss Diana? Yes. Yes, sure. Or yes, no problem. Sure. Oh, oh, sí. Yes, no, no. problem. <laughs> no, would you like to be famous? ¿Te gustaría ser famosa? Be famous? Yes. Mm. Nice, me. <laughs> what kind of like influencer, me? <laughs> like TikTok? Be ganan mucho dinero. <laughs> oh, nice. Yes, it's true. It's true. That's true. Thank you, Miss. Very good. Let's go, Carlos Miguel. Would you like to be an influencer? Um, no, I can't. Oh, why it's not? <laughs> uh -huh, it's, it's, it's a bad thing. Oh, really? Why? No me gusta llamar tanto la atención. Oh, okay. So that's, okay. It's true. So influencers, you have to call the attention. Definitely. Very good. Let's see. Next one. Um, it would be, please, please, Miss Clelia. Would you like to go to college? Or I don't know yes. if you... Or yes, sure. sure. Ya fuiste a la university or no? Yes. Okay, so so you are ready. Okay, perfect. What college, Miss, or what university? Uh, Francisco David. Ah, oh, nice. Very good. Okay, let's see. Next one. Let's see. Adriana, Miss Adriana, would you like to be invisible? Uh, yes, I, I would like. Oh, really? Why, Miss? Why do you want to be invisible? Mm, para, para pasar desapercibido. Why? No. <laughs> okay, to be a, like invisible to how will be desapercibido? Oh my goodness, that's the first word that I I just know. Okay, to nobody note, okay? Okay, so thank you, me, for giving me that answer. Let's see next one. It would be Anna Marleni. Yes, teacher. Would you like to be, I mean, would you like to go on a date with someone? Sorry, I can't. Oh, sorry, I can't. Because I'm married. <laughs> uh, but with your husband then, would you like to go on a date with your husband? Yes. Oh, nice. Sure. <laughs> That's good. Excellent. Let's go next one. Let's go with Miss Blanca. Ah, no, Miss Blanca, you're ready, right? Quiero ver que me falta. Oh, it would be. Quiero ver que más no está de hoy. Ah, Miss, Mr. Serafin, would you like to swim with sharks? To swim with sharks. Si me gustaría nadar con tiburones. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yes, sure. Really? Yes. Nice. It's a, it's a um, adrenaline, no sé, adrenalina. Uh -huh, adrenaline, yeah, sure. definitely. Oh, nice, Mister. Thank you for sharing. Thank you. Nice, nice. Let's see, next one. Miss Rebecca, would you like to climb my mountain? Yes, yeah, sure. Oh, really? Which, which one means which one will be? Like El Pital or El Cerro Verde or Mount Everest or El Monte Everest. I don't know. Mm -hmm. um, Ilamatepec Volcano. Oh, nice, Miss. 
Nice, nice. That's good. Thank you for sharing, everybody. Very, very good. Okay, now let's go and do attendance section. Muy bien. Gracias a todos por participar. Ahora vamos con sección de asistencia. Please activate your cameras, everybody. Please, please. And remember to say presente, okay? So let's start. Adriana Gabriela. Presente, teacher. Thank you. Um, Ana Marleni. Presente. Thank you. Blanca Luz. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Miguel. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Roberto. Ay, ya lo vi, mister. Hello. No se escucha, mister. Okay, but I see you. No, no, no. Uh -huh. Yes, I see you. I see you. Present. I see you. You say present. Christian Alexander. Maybe Mr. Christian, but I don't know. Mr. Christian, are you there? No, okay. Claudia Maria. Mm -mm, tampoco. Lelia Estela. Present. Thank you. David Emanuel. Present. Thank you. Diana Noemi. Present. Thank you. Edwin Roberto. Jenny, Carolina. Present. Thank you. Jorge Luis, Jose Dimas, Julio Cesar. Present. Thank you. Karen Estefanía. Present. Thank you. Nilton Alexander. Present. Thank you. Rodrigo José. Ruth Rebeca. Present teacher. Thank you. Serafín. Mr. Serafín. Present, present. Uh, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Present. Maria Jamilet. Maria Jamilet. Uh, I don't know. No, nobody has said. Maria Jamilet. La veo ahí, Miss, pero you have to say presente. Carmen Guadalupe. Okay. Ana Verónica. Present. Thank you. Marlene Oneida. Juan Ezequiel. Present. María y Emilia, ¿verdad? Wait a second. Uh, and then we have Juan Ezequiel. Okay. Yes, Mr. I know that you're oyente, but you have to stay presente. Something very important. Algo muy importante que aclararles, chicos. Y... Este, Ana Verónica, ok. Que es importante que cuando ustedes ingresan a la clase, que, eh, ustedes tienen que estar acá con la cámara encendida, porque yo veo que algunos la apagan después de la, de la asistencia. Claro que si se tienen que levantar, pues claro que la pueden apagar, vea, porque yo sé que a veces pues, pues no da pena, vea. Pero la tenemos que tener encendida. Le voy a decir, una de las razones es porque si la tenemos encendida es como que estamos, a, eh, hago un mal movimiento, me llama, pero yo ya sé que ahí está la cámara, ¿ok? Que está encendida. Entonces, eh, esa es una. Y la otra es que estamos en la trabajación, ¿ok, Mr. Edwin? No lo escuché ya rato. Entonces, bueno, no había leído ese mensaje. Entonces, este, por favor, les pido que la tengan encendida, ¿ok? Solo que si es algo muy urgente, porque así, aunque tengan, yo sé que ahorita ya es una hora que algunos ya estamos con sueñito, porque también yo, o sea, ya estamos cansados del día, pero miren, recuerden, el tiempo pasa súper rápido, no se siente, como les digo, si tienen la cámara encendida, ustedes van a sentir como que alguien, obviamente, yo los estoy viendo, ¿verdad? Entonces es como que estamos un poco alerta, ¿verdad? No podemos hacer como que no vamos a dormir, <ríe> porque estamos con la cámara encendida, ¿ok? Y es importante porque eso también cuenta, como que estén acá, ¿ok? Eh, y cuenta en el sentido de que pues cuando chequean la grabación ahí van a ver que ustedes estaban, ok, entonces y se les ponen los minutos, porque fíjense que yo le pongo ahí que ustedes han venido, 
con un 1, pero más no pongo los minutos, sino que alguien más chequea mañana, el día siguiente, vea la grabación y pone los minutos. Y de hecho a varios, yo acabo de notar que les están llamando. ¿Por qué? Porque les estamos viendo que solo algunos minutitos se conectan. O no sé si alguien ya recibió una llamada y entonces este, es por eso que se les está llamando. Y varios están diciendo que pues, no, no contestaron, pero sí se les está llamando porque muy pocos minutos se conectan y la, o la mayoría del tiempo pues tienen ahí oyente y recuerden que para que usted pueda y les he dicho desde el primer día creo que les dije que para que usted pueda desarrollar el habla inglés tiene que participar no puede estar todos los días de oyente ok porque tiene que participar es importante para desarrollar una habilidad así es que espero que todo de mañana en adelante si es posible yo sé que algunos andan en la cena navideña otros ya están pero están de oyente o andan en algún lugar pero están de oyente pero cuando regresen a sus casas pues puedan continuar Ok, eso espero. Ok, eh, and thank you y gracias a todos de igual manera. Yo sé que lo están haciendo súper bien, pero vamos a intentarlo un poco más. Ok, I know you can do better. Let's go ahead and continue and start with today's class. Vamos a empezar con la clase del día de ahora. And today we're going with, uh, as I told you, with unit number three. Como les dije, vamos a continuar con la unidad número tres. Y we are going to the manual in page 31. Okay, give me one second. And in page 21, we have this. We have uh, this question, very important question, by the way. And it says here, okay. So every company, I think almost every company, creo que todas las compañías tienen, tienen una regulation about employees behavior, tienen como una regulación, unas reglas para el, des, el comportamiento de los empleados. Can you tell me three examples? Like for example, in my case, it would be regulations, it would be maybe don't speak on the phone, okay? Notice don't speak on the, me, I cannot speak on the phone. That's one, two, I cannot eat. Obviously, porque no puedo estar hablando, vean, en la clase. So, no eating in the class. That's another one. But for you, pero para ustedes, ¿cuáles son algunas regulations que tienen en su job, en su trabajo? Can you mention some of them? ¿Me podrían mencionar algunos de ellas? Bloque uh, uh, social media network. No. Don't use it in the work. No. Oh, okay. Nothing. Like nothing like nothing like WhatsApp. Nothing. Um I think WhatsApp, yes, Mr. Uh, because Facebook, ah, okay. Facebook, Instagram, Instagram Snapchat, uh -huh. I mean TikTok. Yes. <laughs> Ajá, okay. pero WhatsApp, I think, es que ahorita WhatsApp, I think, es something important, porque ahí es como que te comunicas todo y super easy, en vez de una llamada, un mensajito rápido, ¿verdad? So, uh -huh. but what about the other ones? ¿Y los demás? ¿Qué otras regulaciones tienen? Teacher, we can use the cell phone. Where, Miss? In the job? Yeah. But, wow. but I'm I working at the call center. Ah. Definitely, you have to use it, right? The phone, it's very necessary. No WhatsApp, no. No, you cannot. No. I really? Cannot. Yeah. Oh my goodness me. De hecho, dejamos nuestros teléfonos afuera en los casilleros guardados. What? Me, yeah. I'm so sorry. But I think now they, well, anyways, it's different, right? Where me is in TP? <laughs> <laughs> is it is it TP? Because it's TP, yes. Okay, okay, so yeah, that's one. Okay, so cell phones, another one. Maybe the clothes, puede ser uno que la ropa, que tienen que ir formal. No eat. No eating. Oh. No eat. No eat, okay. The, the hours levels. Okay, on the, in the job, yeah, and the working yes. now. Yeah, definitely, very good, Serafin, thank you. What about the other ones? ¿Cómo se dice sandalias? Ah, use or wear sandals. Uh -huh. We can wear sandals. Ah, wear sandals. Definitely. Yes, no. Genus. <laughs> ah, flip-flops. 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 Flip-fl
No, but that would be pero, pero ah, suelte. Ah, really? Eh, so it would be it would be pelo suelto. Oh my god, I don't know. We need to use makeup. You need to need to use makeup. Yeah. <laughs> what? It's my first time. Need to use better way, like. Sweat. De hecho, nos mandaron a una capacitación de cómo nos tenemos que maquillar. What? It's my first yeah. time listening to that. Miss, but neither Bianca for that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, no, uh, no tennis shoes. Ah, pelo suelto. Solo estoy buscando pelo suelto because I forgot how to say pelo suelto. Ah, uh, free hair. I don't remember about that, but okay. Free hair, tennis shoes. No, no. <laughs> tennis. Okay, tiny shoes, eh, free hair, but I don't think it's free hair, but okay, let's see the free hair. I think so. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Any other thing? Use the uniform all uh -huh. day. Ah, use the uniform. Very good. Excellent. Thank I, you. Mm -hmm. I can go with short. You can't, uh, oh my goodness, no, wear shorts. Eso sí, no, miren, wear shorts. Excellent. Anything else? But what about behavior? ¿Qué tal the behavior? For example, recently uh, there was a teacher that said mean words or rude words, okay? Don't say... Sí, 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 sí. Uh -huh. Mean words, pa malas palabras. You cannot say mean words in your jobs. I guess so, creo, ¿verdad? Que nadie puede acá. So, en sus trabajos. Anything else? En, en mi trabajo, por ejemplo, no, entre con los mismos compañeros del área no podemos tener novio o relaciones oh, amorosas. Don't have este, eh, relationships. Relationships. Me too, Miss. In my job, no, we cannot have relationships exactly. Anything else? Teacher. Mm -hmm. eh, ¿Cómo sería por eh, business card? Business. O sea, portar, portar, portar visiblemente el carnet. Ah, no. ok. Eh, so it will be. Wear the business card. Always, always wear the business card. Mm -hmm. Something else, because there are many things, like, for example, maybe um, touch or, or hug, touch or hug uh, co-workers. I, there are some places that they don't allow that, right? Hay, hay algunos lugares que no permiten que toques o abraces a un compañero de trabajo, right? Only like hi from far, right? Mm -hmm. What else? What else? I'm keeping a book. I'm sorry, Miss. But I'm never going to. I'm keeping a book. Marcar los tiempos en el trabajo. Marcar. Marcar. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it will be click. I mean, it will be. Oh my goodness. Marcar, but I think you have to oh checking. Checking. Uh -huh, check, check the check. entrance. The entrance. Uh -huh, the entrance. And check the exit time. Exit time. No smoking. Ah, no it's smoking, definitely, right? Okay, and 
Very good. As you can see, those are the activities, right? All of the behaviors, esos son los, los comportamientos aparte de actividades que ustedes no pueden realizar en su job, right? Now, but for these, okay. I'm sorry, wait. You are going to use some phrases. Give me one second. I just want to use check the, the conversation. Uh -huh, definitely. Okay, so you have to use some words and we are going to see that right now. Here we have, as you can see, we have this conversation. We have Claudia and Raul. Can you help me to read, please? Mr. Serafin and also Miss Jenny's. Can you help me? Miss Jenny, you are Claudia and Serafin, you are Raul. Okay, one, two, three, go. Uh -huh. Miss Jenny's? I can't believe it's Robert is addicted to his phone. Did you see him? You are right. He has showed no chats in a meeting. Absolutely. That, that is not polite. He showed us words. Polite. His message, please. Sorry. No, I just was just saying that it, this one is polite. Solo estaba diciéndole a mí, Jenny's polite. Ajá. Okay, continue. Polite. His short answers, his message after the meetings, and we should not check, show him that it is not polite, polit, uh, sorry, polite either. Either. Polite either. Polite hater. Agree, we shall hit him instead. Okay. Thank you. Should help instead, instead, okay? This word is polite, educado, right? Uh, oh, yeah. And then we have uh, either, tampoco, okay? Either. Okay, as you can see here, we have some words in bold, como pueden ver, um, tenemos dos frases en negrita, por ahí es should not and should, okay? Should and other verb. And those are some phrases y esas son algunas palabritas que vamos a utilizar para expresar las cosas que deben de hacer y las que no se deben de hacer. So we are going to study right now, should and shouldn't. These are modal verbs, okay? And so, so the should and shouldn't, they are used to give an advice, okay? El should y el shouldn't son utilizados para dar un consejo o para uh, also an opinion or give someone about what they should do o también para dar una opinión o dar un consejo, como les decía, acerca de lo que deberías de hacer o no deberías de hacer in negative, right? Then, here we have, and it says, you should or shouldn't to give someone or somebody an advice or say what you think is the right thing to do. Aquí dice que vamos a utilizar el should o el shouldn't para decir, eh, para darle a alguien un consejo o decirle cuál es o qué es lo correcto uh, que se debe de hacer. And look, the structure is super simple y la estructura es, miren, super fácil. So first we have the subject, primero tenemos el sujeto, después tenemos el should, después tenemos shouldn't y después el verbo sin el tú. Okay, so for example, we can say, you should, okay, you should drink water, okay? Deberías tomar agua, right? Because remember that is super important, okay? And then in negative, maybe you... De lo que ustedes estaban diciendo, vea, sería you shouldn't ah, usar zapatos tenis, sería? Yes, no usar. How do you say it in English? Do you remember? You should uh, use you should you wear tennis shoes. You shouldn't wear tennis shoes. Okay. Uh, also, 
Uh, you should. Hmm. Algo que deberíamos de hacer en el trabajo. Vamos a ver, terminar un trabajo. O un reporte. ¿Qué es lo que se les pide a usted? Vamos a ver. Tell me, tell me. Check the, check the notebook, the student. Ah, oh, okay, you're a teacher. Okay, so you should check the notebooks, right? Okay, debería, ¿verdad? Que no debería, otra cosa que no deberíamos de hacer, you shouldn't. Uh, por ejemplo, usar el teléfono sería, you shouldn't. Use their phone. Ajá, uh -huh. use the phone, excellent. You shouldn't use the phone, excellent. And like that, also we have here, aquí, por ejemplo, tenemos la primera, wear sandals, ¿cómo sería? Positiva o neg negativa, definitivamente. Entonces sería, you o she, uh -huh. shouldn't. shouldn't wear sandals, right? Wear sandals. Very, definitely, right? <laughs> Don't use sandals to work. What about flip-flops? El mister dijo flip-flops, chanclas. So, sería... He shouldn't. He shouldn't. Wear flip flops. Wear flip flops. Very good. Okay. Tiene que usar maquillaje. Eso sería. She should. Ajá. Uh -huh. She should use makeup, ¿verdad? Porque eso es algo que le solicitan. She should use makeup. Excellent. What about eh, pelo suelto? Decían ahí que no debe de usar el pelo suelto. Eso sería. She shouldn't. Uh -huh. She shouldn't. Shouldn't. Use. Ajá. Uh -huh. Use. Free hair. Ajá. Uh -huh. Have. Uh, creo que es have. Tener, have free hair, yeah. Es que no me recuerdo que sea free hair, but anyways. Utilizar el uniforme, eso sería. We. We or they. Ok, they. No. Uh -huh. Should. Should. Uniform. Use, use the uniform. Uh -huh, use use the, the uniform. Perfect. Very good. What about wear shorts? Uh, they, they shoes. Wear mm -hmm. shoes. Wear shorts. They shouldn't or should. Shouldn't. No, ah. Shouldn't. Yes, shouldn't wear shorts, definitely. Very good, excellent. What about, ah, chequear la entrada. How do you say that? So, debería. You should. Ajá, uh -huh, you should, right? Check or mark the entrance. Era mark. Mark es la que se, marcar. Mark the entrance. And next one. Check the exit. What will be? You should. You should. Uh -huh. Check the exit mm -hmm. time. Or mark uh -huh, the exit time. Mm -hmm. And no smoking? You should. You should. Mm -hmm. Sure, no. smoking. No smoking. Uh, no. You shouldn't. Sure. Okay, vaya, en este caso, si se fijan acá, smoking, pues sería vea, así con un ING, pero smoke es también fumar porque el. Ay, aquí me equivoqué. I'm sorry, wait. Ahí está. Ok, so, ¿por qué? Porque después del should, recuerden que va el verbo normal, no cambia, acá está, miren. Remember that. Uy, ¿qué es? Here. Ok, the verb is without the to, sin el, sin el to, ok. Ok, so, questions? Do we have any questions so far? Richard, tengo una duda. Uh -huh. Así como tiene en pantalla ahorita la fórmula de poner el verbo en infinitivo con usando tú. Uh 
-huh. En los ejemplos que acaba de poner, no, no usamos tú. Mister, esto significa without, sin. Ah, sin, sin perdón. El tú, oh, ajá. Sin el tú, okay. mister. Ajá. Ok, ok, I, thank you. No problem, mister. Here I have some examples and I want you to read and help me to read. Can you help me to read this one, please, Miss Adriana? Me ayudas a leer, Adriana, please. You should wear a suit to the interview. Yes, very good. What about this one? Um, Blanca. You shouldn't. Drink coffee in the air. Evening. Every, evening. Evening. It it keep you awake. Excellent. Thank you. Okay. And this one. Can you help me to read this one, please, Ana Veronica? Uh, I think you should change your job. I don't think you should speak to her. Exactly. Okay. So when we are using, ok, cuando, esto es algo que recalcar, when we use I think you should, cuando utilizamos I think you should, también podemos utilizarlo en negativo, I don't think you should, que significa no deberías o pienso que deberías, ok, como lo decía, yo pienso que deberías cambiar tu trabajo, I think, antes de should utilizamos el I think y en negativo sería I don't think, okay? Uh, this is just like a phrase. Esa es solo como una frase que pudieran agregar al momento de, si quieren, vea, ah, como un consejo. Ajá, exacto. I think eh, you should work in the platform. <laughs> I don't think you should speak in Spanish, okay? And like that, y así. Let's do a little bit of practice, okay? Vamos a hacer un poquito de práctica with should and shouldn't. Everybody's going to participate. I don't know, okay. So you're going to see, okay, van a ver unas frasecitas y ustedes me van a decir si es should sure or shouldn't. So please be prepared. Por favor, estén preparados. Okay, so let's go with this one. Let's go with Ana Marleni. He's too fat. Uh -huh. Say again. He is too fat. Is sure or shouldn't? He is so fast. Uh -huh. He is so fast. Too fat. Too fat, miss. Too fat. Lo mira Page ahí. 80. No, no, no puedo ver la pantalla. Really? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Age 18. Porque me sacó, me sacó la... ¿Y ahorita, miss? Ahora sí creo yo. Uh -huh. Ah, uh, shouldn't, shouldn't. Okay, wait a second, me, que me, me equivoqué. Me. He shouldn't eat. Yes, very good, Miss. Can you read the sentence, please? He shouldn't. He is of too fat. Mm -hmm. Shouldn't eat some much junk food. Excellent. Thank you, Miss. Let's go with this one. Can you help me, please, Carlos Miguel? Hello. Hello. Um, it's sunny and hot day. They, they should put some, some cream on. Yes, very good, Mr. Thank you. Let's go okay. next one. And let, <coughs> I'm sorry. Let's go, Anna Veronica, please. It's a great film. Mm -hmm. uh, you should go, out, go and see it. Yes, very good, Miss. Thank you. Let's go next one. Blanca Delgado. It is foggy today. significa foggy? Con neblina, Miss. Uh, you should you shouldn't write too fast shouldn't right because this is for we you cannot see very good thank you let's go miss clelia you have an exam tomorrow morning 
you should go to the pride, not children. Ah, <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> That's another level, Miss. Imagínese, siguiente. <laughs> you can party. Nice. Thank you, Miss. Very good. Let's go next one. David and Manuel. She should no, say but, something. Okay, but what is the first sentence? What is it? She, she has a real, terrible terrible Hedge. headache. A headache. She showed they some aspirin. Excellent, mister. Thank you. Let's go, Diana. My eyes are tired. 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 I tired. Mm -hmm. I shouldn't spend much time in front of the computer. Yes, very good, Miss. Thank you. Let's go next one. It would be Miss Jenny's. Your mom is a really busy. Busy, busy. Busy. Mm -hmm. You sure help her with the housework. Housework. Yes, very good. Thank you. Let's go next one. Mr. Julio. You are on library. Mm -hmm. You shouldn't talk too loud. So loud. Very good. Thank you, mister. Let's go next one. Uh, Miss Karen. It's Karen, are you there? It's too cold here. It's too cold here. She should. Shouldn't. Sure. Or should. Should or should. Should. Wear winter clothes. Sí. Debería, eh, I mean, debería o no debería usar ropa de invierno. Should or shouldn't? She shouldn't. No. She should. <laughs> Era should, exactly. Very good. Can you finish, Miss Karen, to read it? ¿Te podría terminar de leer, please, Karen? She should uh -huh. wear winter clothes. Excellent, Miss. Thank you. Very good. Okay, wait a second. Okay, so yeah, that's perfect. Okay, now just to finish with this, just give me one second. I just want to see. Mm -hmm. Okay, now it's your turn. And in this one, uh, it says that I want to say an advice. So what are you going to do? You are going to write an advice for one of your classmates. Van a escribir un consejo para uno de sus compañeros. Okay, like for example, I'm going to go with Mr. Nilton. Hmm. You should hmm, drink, no, eat healthy, okay? El consejo que le doy a Mr. A todos, vean, no solo a Mr. You should eat healthy. Deberías de comer saludable, right? Very important. Es muy importante, okay? Um, so, because if you eat healthy, you are not so tired, okay? Porque a veces también recuerden que la alimentación pues influye, ¿verdad? Si estamos muy, muy cansados y si tenemos mucha energía también, okay? So, you should eat healthy, okay? Y ahora, what are we going to do? We are going to do one positive and one negative. Vamos a hacer una positiva y una negativa, okay? For one of our classmates. Y por ejemplo, le puedo decir a Miss Rebecca, eh, you shouldn't drink Coca-Cola, okay? You can do that, Miss. Don't drink Coca-Cola, Miss, okay? It's not healthy, okay? So that will be. Now, what are we going to do? I want you to create 
one positive for your classmate, one positive advice and one negative advice. Like you shouldn't do, like you shouldn't do something like you are going to tell them, okay? So let's try it, please. I'm gonna give you four things. I'm gonna give you uh, maybe three minutes, three minutes so you can create them. But don't send any WhatsApp. No lo vayan a enviar en WhatsApp because after we are going to do it here. Porque después vamos a hacer la práctica acá. Okay, so let's do it. Let's write, 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 please. Right, right, right. The example, the, the advice for your um, classmates, okay? Let's go. One more minute. Finished. Okay, thank you. Okay, let's see. I want to listen to first. Uh, let's go. Jenny's, can you tell me one number from one to five? Me dices un número de one to five, Jenny's? One to five. Three. Three, okay. One, two, three. Adriana, Adriana, who is your classmate? Can you compañero? Tell me, tell me. ¿Cómo dice? ¿A quién elegiste para darle el consejo? ¿O a nadie le dijiste? No. ¿No? No. <ríe> ¿Y a quién le vas a dar el consejo? ¿A tu mamá, a tu papá, a tu hermano, a tu brother, sister? A todos. Uh, ¿Tú? ¿A todos? Sí. To everybody. Ok, tell me. Uh, you show uh -huh. take care of the environment. Ah, take care of the environment. Environment. Mm -hmm. Oh, very good. Yes, everybody. Don't throw trash. 
in the streets, right? <laughs> Don't do it. Yeah. Very good. Let's go. Next one. You show me. Uh-huh. Okay. Your money. You shouldn't. Got, got, got your money. What is that? Gastar. Uh-huh. Malgastar yes. dinero. Uh, waste. Waste. Ajá, es, es el W-A-S-T-E, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. uh, waste. Waste Wait. your money. Definitely uh -huh. no malgastar. Don't waste your money, everybody. Don't. You shouldn't. Okay, very good, me. Uh -huh. Thank you. Okay, let's go. Adriana, tell me one color, please. Miss Adriana. Color. Uh -huh. Red. Red. Miss Karen, Miss Karen tiene aquí. Ah, yo soy Mr. Julio. <laughs> Miss Karen, but your your little here, your neck neckline in your in your shirt is red. Tell me, to who is the advice? A quién le vas a dar un advice? Mm, no elegí a nadie, pero. Okay. <laughs> tell me, tell uh, me, everybody. Uh, you sure? Uh huh. Sure. Eat vegetables. Definitely, everybody. Eat vegetables. Very good. Okay, next one. Um, you should 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 shouldn't uh, shouldn't should uh -huh. should drink so much coffee. Ah, uh, yeah. Don't drink coffee. Drink co <laughs> no, no, don't drink. Very good. Thank you, Miss Karen. Karen, tell me one number, please. Um, six. Six. Okay. One. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. Carlos Miguel. Hi. Hi, tell me your sentences. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> ah, okay. You show, uh -huh. you show drink water much. Yes, you should drink uh, a lot of water. Very good. Um, mm -hmm. She should not, not do bad things. Definitely. ¿Quién? Who? Tell us um, who. <laughs> everybody <laughs> yes everybody okay. for okay. everybody you should study english much uh, very good mr excellent sentence and, i love it <laughs> and you should do 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 homework yeah, yeah. very good mr amazing <laughs> thank you mr you <laughs> thank todo deben de hacer el work and the platform and homework everything okay very Extra good. Point. No, Extra no points, no points. No points. <laughs> <laughs> no That's okay, like with working. Okay, Carlos Miguel, tell me one color. Um, Red. Red. Mr. Julio, then. Solo red, no, Mr. Otro color. Ah, okay. Black, white, uh, black, blue. I mean. Blue. Yellow. Blue. 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 Blue, nobody has blue. Oh, David Emanuel, que tiene algo, creo que es. Juan, Juan ¿Ah? Ezequiel tiene un color azul. Really? Ay, pero es que no puede porque le está oyendo. Ah, no, 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 ya vino, ya vino. Ya vino, ya vino ah. mesa. Ok, general, uh, we sure uh, go for a room. What? <laughs> we should uh, go for a room. Go for a room. For a run. <laughs> for a run. Ah, run. Yeah, 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 ah, yeah. okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I understand something. And you shouldn't? Uh, you shouldn't eat free food. <laughs> ah, definitely. Don't eat este junk food. It's true. Don't do it. You shouldn't. Thank you, Mr. Mr. Tell me one color. Este... Purple. Purple. Ah, Mr. David. Ay, ya lo había visto, Mr. No, ese sí fue intencional, Mr. Ya. Yeah. Ya, Mr. David. Okay, okay teacher. Eh, uh -huh. eh, you should greet uh -huh. all, the, all the people. Okay. You should, sorry. Y you should, should not uh -huh. dry without. Uh, license. License. It definitely license. very good. Don't do it. Exactly. You shouldn't do it. Excellent. David Manuel, tell me one color. 
is green. Green. Ah, Rebecca, Miss Rebecca, you have green wall. Tiene una pared green over there. Okay, tell me your sentences. You should mm -hmm. read a book frequent, frequently. Ah, Very good. I love it. I love it. Excellent. Okay, next one. You shouldn't smoke because it's bad for your health. Very good. Excellent. But if you're doing that's okay too, right? <laughs> that's okay. Don't don't worry. Just an example. Miss Rebecca, tell me one color, please. Yellow. Yellow. Ah, oh, yo me acuerdo que había alguien. Ah, Miss Ana Verónica, it's the yellow one. Uh, tell me, Miss, para quién va? No han elegido a nadie. Oh my goodness, and I want to know. <laughs> Advice for my classmates. For everybody, for everybody, Miss. Yes. Okay, uh, tell me. Okay. Uh, uh -huh. uh, you should, uh, you should sleep uh, eight hours a day. Very good, excellent. And you should exercise every day. You, sh you, uh, should, mm -hmm, you mm -hmm. should use a face mask for COVID. And oh. you should not eat junk food. <laughs> yeah, don't do it. Miss, what is the FaceTime calling? I don't understand that one. The, the, the number three. Number three? Uh huh. La de, la de, la de la mascarilla. Ajá, uh -huh. I didn't understand that one. You should use a face mask for COVID. For COVID, ah, uh -huh. face COVID. mask. Esa es la mascarilla por, la, por el COVID. Do you know what I understand? For calling, and I was for calling. No, the, for COVID, for ah, COVID. Ah, the face mask, yes, you should do it. Okay. Very good, Miss, excellent job, thank you. Miss Ana Verónica, can you tell me one number from one to 10? Uh, five. five. Five, okay, so it would be, I mean, one, two, three, four, five. Nilton, let's go, Mr. Nilton. For who? Okay. Your advice. Uh, mm -hmm. Uh, you should walk every day. Definitely walk, uh huh. And you shouldn't drive fast. Oh, de very good. Yeah, because too many accidents, right? Muchos accidents. Yeah. yeah, so drive slow. You should do it, right? Very good, Mister. Thank you. Nilton, tell me one number from one to ten again. Uh, eight. Eight, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ah, no, pero es oyente. Ay, everybody is oyente. Okay, Miss, Miss, it would be, Miss Blanca, tell me. Mm, and she shouldn't eat pizza. Ah, she shouldn't eat. She or he, o quien es, who is that person? She, para ella. Ok, para pero... <laughs> Only the girls, miss. Los boys también no tienen que comer eh, pizza. Uh -huh. And? Um, uh, he should study English every day. Very good. I love your <laughs> advice. I love them. <laughs> Very good, Miss Lanka. <laughs> I me encanta esos consejos. You should study English every day. Excellent. Okay, now that was perfect. Okay, I know that some of you haven't participated. Yo sé que algunos de ustedes todavía no han pasado, pero ahorita vamos a continuar y en la próxima actividad sí quiero lo van a participar el resto. Okay. So in this one it says pair work, and in here we have. What are some be polite behaviors, okay? En todos los trabajos, como ustedes saben, hay polite behaviors. And that you expect, I'm sorry, wait. That you expect from your co-workers. And what are some rude behaviors? Rude is eh, maleducado. In behavior, Um, behavior is comportamiento o trato, okay? No, sería comportamiento, 
Y, y también significa, uh, ya, yeah, comportamiento, básicamente. Y recuerden que hay dos tipos de comportamiento, vea, el good or polite, ok. Y está el bad o el rude, ok. El rude behavior, eh, que es el mal educado. So, in this one, I'm going to put you to work in pairs, ok. So, you can write some uh, behaviors that you expect and some behaviors that you don't expect from your class, from your coworkers, ok. Entonces, lo que, lo que van a hacer es que escriban qué es lo que esperan de sus compañeros. Para, por ejemplo, en positivo sería de coworkers, vamos a poner coworkers, should eh, say good morning, ¿verdad? O greetings, greetings, saludos, ¿verdad? Eh, otro comportamiento agradable o educado sería coworkers should, ¿qué deberían de hacer? Mm, share share important information, ¿ok? Important information. Ahora, algo que no esperamos de nuestros compañeros es coworkers shouldn't uh, wear sandals, let's say. Okay. Ah, no, pero es para comportamiento. Sorry. Wait, 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 wait. The coworkers shouldn't hmm, drink alcohol. That's another one. Something that is not good, right? Drink alcohol or co workers shouldn't. Que no deberían de hacer de comportamiento. Hmm. Speak loud, hablar fuerte, digamos. Speak okay. down. Es, I'm sorry? Uh, uh, green tone, algo así. What is that? ¿Cómo qué, mister? Hablar fuerte, algo así. Ah, uh, speak gritar, loud. Gritar. Uh -huh. Oh, ah, uh, shout out. Shout. 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 Solo sería shout, mister. Que gritar. Ajá. Uh -huh. Speak loud es hablar fuerte. So, yeah. Okay, okay so, um, we are going to do that. Eso es lo que vamos a hacer. Vamos a escribir dos afirmativas de coworkers, que es lo que deberían de hacer sus compañeros de trabajo, y dos que no deberían de hacer, ¿ok? But we are going to work in pairs, pero vamos a trabajar in pairs, okay? Because it's very important. Please, please try to speak in English, okay? Let's try. Vamos a intentar hablar in English because you are not trying and I want you to try. Quiero que lo intente, okay? Ya les había dicho anteriormente, try to do it in Spanglish. Tratemos de hacer Spanglish, ¿verdad? Porque hay palabras que sí, que así como Sofía Vergara, que hace mitad Spanish y mitad English, okay? You can do it. Try to do it, okay? Give me one second. I just want to see. Okay. Oh no. Aquí quedamos a little bit wrong. Five and seven. Okay. So for this, I'm going to give you five minutes so you can write the four sentences. In this one, you have to send them in the WhatsApp group. Es así, las vamos a mandar en el grupo de WhatsApp so I can check them out when you finish. Cuando terminen, pues les envíen en el grupo, okay? Five minutes, okay? Let's work. Questions? Questions, questions? Y aquí deberíamos utilizar siempre la forma que usted nos estaba mostrando de should. Yes, exactly. Solo que vamos a... Ajá, sí. Nada más que en vez de decir... En vez de decir you, vamos a decir co-workers. Porque recuerden que eso... Yo creo que me digan qué es lo que esperan y qué es lo que no esperan. Ajá. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Solo eso es el sujeto que van a decir co-worker should o co-worker shouldn't. Ok. Ok. Any other question? Otra duda o pregunta, chicos? Or we are good. Ok, so let's work. Everybody, please. Five minutes. Accept the invitation. Thank you. Let's go. Let's go.
accept invitation, please, Claudia. Edwin, Carlos, Argueta, and Carlos Elias, please accept invitation. Anna Marleni. In early. In early. A worker shouldn't talk too much. Um, como pasar mucho tiempo en el teléfono, no deberías pasar mucho tiempo en el teléfono en el trabajo. Uh, the co -work, the co worker shouldn't. Hello, teacher. Uh, yes. The change is a uh, sujeto, sí. Yes, co-workers. Co-workers. Uh -huh. Co-workers, uh, no you, you co-workers now. Lo que esperamos que ellos hagan, sí, verdad. Yes, exactly. Lo que ellos hagan y lo que no esperan, like rude, mean uh -huh. things. Uh -huh. Y ¿Cuántas más o menos dijo? Two and two, two and two. I told you two. Ah, ya, yeah, ya, yeah, ya, yeah. thank you. Ah, pues no ya problem. las tengo. <laughs> sí, 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 sí. Oh, my goodness. No, pero solo otras dos más. Ok. Ah, la mía extra. <laughs> Co worker should arriba, arriba, early. Should arrive, arrive. So, co worker should arrive, arrive early. Podemos poner también. Eh, co-worker eh, on the camera in the class yes so mm -hmm. is, uh, the co-worker is um, the keeps keep so, distance distance, distance. distance. No sé cómo dice distanciamiento, distance, distance. social, no sé. Social distancing. Short. Social. Distancing. Ajá, distancing. Distancing. Social yeah, two, distancing. Two meters. Meters. Metros. Meters. 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 Mm -hmm, very good. One meters. Two. Distancing, pero si lleva el short distancing no debería de ir ING, ¿verdad? No, should oh. eh, do. Should do social distancing. Hacer, do. Do. Ajá. Mm. So, co-workers should do social distancing. Ok. Ok, perfect. Y el keep, mantenerse, es, se puede utilizar keep. Definitely, definitely. Keep. Two meters apart. Okay. okay. Sería be late. Be... Ah, sí, ¿verdad? ¿Cómo sería horario? Miss. Horario en inglés. Schedule. Schedule. Ahorita okay. se los mando. Schedule. Es a decirlo iba yo, pero. Schedule. Ah. La quité la, la idea ahí. The schedule. 
pues sería schedule, schedule work. O, o sea, work los, schedule. Work schedule. O sea que cuando son así, tiene que ir primero. Ajá. El lugar. Ajá. Podría ser school. School schedule también. Podría ser horario de escuela. Ajá. Uh -huh. School schedule, exactly. Eh, si, si busca David, diga las suyas para ver si están bien escritas. Mientras yo la voy agregando aquí al, 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 al chat y yo luego digo la mía. Teacher, es uh -huh. cor correct. Co-worker should not come, not come late to work. Excellent. Co-worker shouldn't uh, come late for work. Uh -huh. Okay. Eh, y who work a shul, ¿cómo, es, ¿cómo se pronuncia el shul con not unido? Shuren, shuren. 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 Uh -huh. Who work a shuren, report everything to bosses. Uh -huh. Excellent, very good. Those are good sentences. Pero de, de sí, eh, sí, por sí. ejemplo, hello. Sí. Pero no, diga, de. Diga, perdón. Es que lo que pasa es que yo les estaba diciendo de cómo, por ejemplo, de cosas que ellos uh -huh. deberían de... Ustedes esperan, vea, por ejemplo, cosas, comportamientos que ellos no deberían de tener. Por ejemplo, que griten, que, que lleguen tarde, very good, eso sí. Este, uh -huh. Por ejemplo, uh -huh. que les digan malas palabras, ok. That's what I want you to, to say. Voy a decir las mías, voy a decir las mías, mis. Ok. Coworker should greet it. Greetings. Greetings. Ajá. Do say greetings. Greetings. Ajá. Say greetings. Ajá. Very good. Coworker shouldn't create bad mouthing. Los compañeros no deben hablar, no deben hablar de otro. <laughs> ah. Okay. Very good. Ajá. No decir, o sea, porque chambre en inglés no se traduce ahí, sino se traduce por eso. Gossip. Gossip. Ah, eso es. Sí, gossip, así como oh, gossip girl. Ay, verdad. Yes. Ah. Ajá, como gossip. gossip. Ah, esa palabra. Ajá. A los expertos dije yo mejor hablar de otros. Ah, <risa> pero puede ser también, ajá, the coworker shouldn't talk about others. Others. Mm -hmm. okay. 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 You're good, Teacher, you're good. Teacher, cambiando, cambiando la, la oración. Uh -huh. Coworker should be kind to everyone excellent very good yeah that's a good one too very good la de David, también, la de cumplir con el horario de trabajo. Esa, exactly that one that is the one that i told you was perfect yes very good the schedule yeah that's something important okay let's finish okay one more minute okay thank you okay bye. perfect okay. thank you very good very good shall, shall, shall not Sure. Sí, este como lleva contract, ¿cómo es un contract? Ajá, no contractada, sure ¿Está contractada? Ajá, no es que Shouldn't, shouldn't, shouldn't. Shouldn't, sure. ajá. Sure. La cuatro sería con work shouldn't también, ¿verdad? Igual tiene, ajá, tiene que no dejarle espacio. Sure, okay. Bueno, okay. Lo pego entonces así en el WhatsApp. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Finish the show. Okay, but you should be doing your do. sentences. Do you send your sentences? Yes. Oh, yes. I just saw them. Excellent, very good. Okay, let's go back, okay? Thank you for doing okay. your sentences, okay? Vamos a regresar. Thank you. Okay, so I'm going to be waiting your sentences in the group, please send them. Can you send the please over there? Les estamos digitando. 
Okay, thank you. I'm gonna give you one more minute so you can send them, okay? Hello. Hello. Send your sentences, remember, okay? Estoy esperando las, las oraciones. Ah, okay. Um, okay, thank send you. Send you for WhatsApp? Yes, in the group of WhatsApp. Everybody send them to me. I have Miss Jenny's. Shoot, funny. What is funny, Miss? Miss Jenny's? Chistoso? Ah, B. Be funny. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. Shoot, sure. be funny. Funny con U. Funny. Ajá, le es la U. Shouldn't okay. be. Uy, qué es. Teacher. Mm -hmm. Shouldn't be liars. Ajá. Uh -huh. A question. Tell eh, me. Cuando usted nos decía que las oraciones las hiciéramos en base al comportamiento, mm -hmm. es porque should se usa solamente para ese. ese... No. Para comportamiento o, o el ejercicio de, de ahorita. Es así Ajá, el más. ejercicio era básicamente. Bueno, no, el shooting, el shooting se utiliza para, eh, para dar un consejo. Ok, uh -huh. entonces, pero ahorita eh, como estamos hablando acerca de comunicación, verdad? Entonces, sí, está, sí. hemos estado hablando del trabajo y todo eso. Entonces, por eso quería que ustedes dieran consejos a sus compañeros de trabajo. Okay, ¿Qué okay. es lo que ustedes esperan? Pero todo el shooting, el shooting, también lo pueden este, utilizar, por ejemplo, como, así como estábamos al principio, dando un consejo a nuestros compañeros. Pero también podemos okay. darlo a nuestros compañeros de trabajo, que es lo que ustedes estaban haciendo. ¿Ok, mister? Ok, okay. Mm -hmm. for example, Pero, for example eh, mm -hmm. is correct. Eh, you shouldn't drink Coca-Cola at night. Yes, I know. Yes, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Very okay. good. But it's my coffee. It's my ah. coffee for the night. <laughs> okay. Very good, Mister. But yeah, it's very good. This is a good advice. This is a excellent consejo. Very good, Mister. Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna check. Just give me one second. Very good, thank you, Karen and Rebecca. Very good, Clelia, Maria, and Marley. Very good. Uh, very good also, Milton or Nilton? Que no es Nilton. Yes, Nilton. Ah, okay. Yes, sure. uh, Nilton and me. <laughs> Pero lo siento, creo que fue el autocorrector del teléfono del yeah. del, del okay. teclado. Okay. <laughs> and I was like, what? Porque si lo escribí Nilton. Okay, okay. Uh, very good, David, Verónica, and Edwin. Ve detach. Hmm. Make fun of other. Yeah, definitely. Adriana, Adriana, who else was with you, Adriana? Ah, Carlos and Serafín. Very good. Excellent sentences. Who is missing? No se le oye a Ana. Ana Verónica está hablando, pero no se le oye. Really? No, no, no. no. <laughs> Okay, I think everybody sent their sentences. I think, yeah. Thank you. The sentences are super good. I think this is a very easy topic. You have, haven't had so many troubles. repeat <laughs> at work. Definitely, you shouldn't do that. You should be sober working. <laughs> Don't do it. Okay. So remember, what does it mean by behavior? ¿Qué significaba behavior? ¿Quién se recuerda? Vamos a ver una vez más. Let's see if you remember. Comportamiento, conducta. Comportamiento. 
Exactly, comportamiento o conducta. Excellent. Okay, here now we have how to use should and shouldn't just to finish with the topic. Okay, and here we have these sentences. And can you help me please to read these two sentences? Please mm. help me, please, Marlene. Bonita. The word. The guard? The guard. Uh -huh. Shoes and wear. answer. Answer my good morning. Gre gre Greeting. Greeting. Mm -hmm. Linda? Linda shores. Great. Great. We uh, find. Firm. Firm. Um, Dress. With a firm handshake. Handshake. Yes, handshake. Can you help me to read this one, please, uh, Rebecca? Um, the supervisor. Mm -hmm. Supervisor mm -hmm. should use a get getting in the emails. Very good. And then and the last one is this one. One more time. You should say please when you ask when you ask for a favor. 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 Mm -hmm. Very good. So as you can see here, it says you should y después que usamos infinitive or pay form después del should. ¿Qué utilizamos? Un infinitivo, o sea, el infinitivo que lleva el tú. Oye, utilizamos el, la base form. Base form. Exactly. We use the base form. ¿Por qué? Porque el verbo no lleva nada más, ¿verdad? And eh, of the verb. And so, and also we say, in look, remember that we say a direct suggestion. Recuerden que pues lo que hacemos con el shooter y con el shooter es decir una sugerencia directa. So, no debes de hacer o debes de hacer, ¿verdad? Y aquí está, next one, sentences in negative. Help me to read this one, please, David Emanuel. Ok. Lo que está marcado ahorita. Yes. In a square. And Darío, mm -hmm. Darío should not use many emojis in this in his emails. Mm -hmm. Helen should not speak so lowly. Thank you. Next one, help me to read, please. Karen Perez. Gabriel sure not the ter sexiest, sexiest. Uh -huh. joke, joke. Uh -huh. your boss should not should shout shout up you excellent thank you miss okay now here we have what do we use after should not or shouldn't what should we say what do we use? A base form or an infinitive? ¿Qué utilizamos después del should? Verb. The infinitive or the base form? Pero ¿cómo sería el verbo? Eh, infinitivo, o sea, con el tú o sin el tú, base form. Without tú. Exactly. It's the base form without the two. Excellent. And remember that in negative, we are going to use a suggestion about something that is not appropriate, okay? Cuando es negativo, pues estamos diciendo una sugerencia acerca de algo que no es apropiado de hacer, ¿verdad? Y ustedes lo acaban de hacer súper, súper bien. Thank you for doing it, by the way. And now, questions so far about this? Question? Sí. 
Okay, so I think no questions. Okay, in this one, it says, provide a suggestion about the next situation at work. Como pueden ver, tenemos aquí four situations. We have the first one, and it says, Peter is the new supervisor. Ahí tenemos la primera situación. He said, Peter is el nuevo supervisor, and he likes to give orders. He never says please. Él no, a él eh, le gusta dar órdenes, pero nunca dice please. Entonces, ¿qué es lo que debería de ser Peter? Peter, it says here, Peter should ask for like requests, or maybe Peter should say please when he asks for something, okay? Ahora tenemos la number two, la number three, and number four. What I want you to do is that I want you to give a, an advice to these people. I quiero que le demos un consejo a estas personas, a three people, okay? So I'm gonna give you three minutes, no, four minutes, so you can complete this one, okay? Okay, so I'm gonna give you, you have three more minutes. Remember that you have to give an advice using should or shouldn't. Recuerden que deben de dar un consejo utilizando el should or el shouldn't. Ready or not yet? Ready? While you finish, I'm gonna do a tenant section. Mientras termina, voy a hacer sección de asistencia, okay? Because it's already time, porque es hora. Okay, so please say presente. Remember, you have to activate your cameras. Recuerden que tienen que tener activas sus cámaras para que pueda ser posible eh, la asistencia en OK, right? So, Adriana Gabriela. Present. Thank you. Ana Marleni. Presente. Thank you. Blanca Luz. Presente. Thank you. Carlos Miguel. Presente. Thank you. Carlos Roberto. Presente. Chair. Thank you. Cristian Alexander. Ok. Claudia María. Ok. 
¿Quién está por acá? Audio. Ah, Cristian. ¿No? Clelia Estela. Present. Thank you. David Emanuel. Present. Thank you. Diana Noemi. Present. Thank you. Edwin Roberto. Jenis, Carolina. Present teacher. Thank you, Jorge Luis. Jose Dimas. Julio Cesar. Present. Thank you, Karen Estefanía. Present. Nilton Alexander. Present. Thank you, Rodrigo José. Ruth Rebeca. Present teacher. Thank you, Serafín. Present teacher. Thank, thank you, Mr. Maria Jamilet. Present. Thank you, Miss Carmen Guadalupe. Ana Verónica. Present. Thank you, Marlin Oneida. Present. Thank you, Juan Ezequiel. Present teacher. Very good, and thank you everybody for doing the attendance section. Excellent, excellent. Ok, so, do you finish or not yet? ¿Ya terminamos haciendo los consejos a cada una? Or not? So, the one of them. Ay, no. Here we have it. Finish. Somebody volunteer to give me an advice for number two. Vamos a ver los que no han participado. Adriana. Mm, number two. Okay, yeah. Carl, so keep it school. Sure. So uh -huh. keep. Uh -huh. His school. His school. Este, mantener la calma. Ah, keep calm. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Carlos should keep calm. Okay, uh -huh. very good. What do you have in number two? Let's see, Miss Clelia. For number two, what do you have? Todos van a tener diferentes ideas, so I want to listen. Um, she should. Mm -hmm. Car. Uh -huh. Para la number two, Miss. Ah, sí, Carl. Carl. Carl, uh -huh, Carl. Carl should be more, more mm -hmm. polite and not yet. Uh, polite and not yes. yet. Yes, very good, Miss. Thank you. Let's see, number three. Can you help me with number three, please, Miss Diana? Um, tengo que leer lo que dice ahí y la respuesta. Yo sí answer me, solo el consejo que usted le da a las personas. Oh. Um, my asen, my asen, assistant, assistant, assistant. Um, yo, uh -huh. eh, como contestar correo, pero 
should uh, should reply. Amable, eh, amablemente. Uh, kind. Replying kind. Oh. Okay. Thank you, Miss. What about you, Mr. Juan Ezequiel? What do you have for the number three? One more time. Okay. Assistant uh, soul as well. My assistant, sure. Sure. Answer. Uh huh. Answer. Uh huh. The email is well. Well. The email. Uh huh. Well. Well, well. Well, ah, very good, Mr. Juan Ezequiel. Thank you. What about number four? Can you help me with number four, Miss? Uh, Mr. Nilton, number four. Ok, teacher, esta uh -huh. no la había terminado, pero sería como no debes bromear, no debes hacer bromas a tus compañeros. Ah, you shouldn't. You shouldn't. Bueno, George, Lucy, Lucy, porque Lucy, es Lucy. Uh -huh. You shouldn't. Lucy, eh, shouldn't. Jokes. Make jokes. Make jokes. About. Your... Co-workers. Uh -huh. Her co-workers. Very oh, okay. good. Yes. Thank you, mister. Very good. Serafín, tell me. Lucy shouldn't. Mm -hmm. Shouldn't. The, um, como llegar temprano a marcar temprano. Ah. Sure. Tarde. Pero, aquí, no. pero ahí dice, mire, mister, el problema dice que Lucy tells, likes to tell jokes in the office and she loves, she loves, she loves. Very lovely. Ajá, pero se ríe muy fuerte y si hace muchos chistes acerca de los compañeros. Uh, uh -huh. Sure and the... Um, De verdad, guardar silencio. Be quiet. Ok. Quiet. Ajá, Lucy, should. Entonces sería should, ¿verdad? No, no debería, sino que should. Ajá. Lucy should be quiet. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Do you have something different for the rest of the class? No sé si alguien más tiene algo diferente for this ones that you want to share que ustedes quieran compartir. Let me know right now. Hi, hi. Okay, uh, number one, um, no, number two, mm -hmm. uh, be show sure count to 10. Peter show uh, regain count. I'm sorry, uh, remain calm. Ah, car. Uh -huh. He show count to 10. Should call. Count, count, contar. Ah, count, count to ten. Count to ten. Ah, uh -huh. definitely. Very good. The Peter show regain count. Remain. Regain. Regain. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Peter should regain. Así? Ah, regain. Gay. Ah, regain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Regain. Uh -huh. Yes. Uh -huh. Regain what? Calm. Calm. Like this? Yes. Okay, thank you. What about uh, the Por other favor. ones? Yes. Lucy, shorts, Ted Jones during working or? Ah, Lucy shouldn't tell jokes during working hours. Definitely. Excellent, Mr. Thank you. Very good. The no, form. debería. Uh huh. She Ajá, shouldn't speak loud in the office. Definitely. She shouldn't speak loud in the office. Definitely, right? And she should use salutation in the, her in her mate. Aha, uh -huh, definitely. Very good. Number three, right, mister? She shouldn't. Yes. She she should, sorry, she should, right? 
use yes. salutation or greetings. Es que no es salutation, greetings. es uh -huh. uh -huh. greetings, greetings. Así se dice saludos, everybody, okay? Uh -huh. La hello y todo eso es greetings. She should use greetings in her uh -huh. emails. Exactly. Very good. Excellent job. Excellent, excellent. Anybody else that wants to give another one? I don't know, any other ideas? ideas? One, two, three, or four, or you're good, or you're fine. Number four. Uh-huh. Uh, Lucy show remember that work is serious and important. Okay, very good, wait. Lucy, vamos a ponerlo por acá. Lucy. Shouldn't laugh, you say, right? At things that are important. Remember that word is serious and important. Ah, which one? One more time, can you say the sentence? No, Lucy. Lucy should. Should, okay, should, uh huh. Should, the... uh -huh. Remember that word. Is serious. Excellent, remember. And important. Work is serious and important. Yeah, don't do that to laugh about other people, right? Not okay. It's not okay to do that. Excellent. Very good with your ideas. I know that everybody has different and very excellent ideas. Thank you for doing it. Yo sé que todos tienen tal vez diferentes a los que acabo de escribir ahí en la, en la, en la práctica, pero lo han hecho súper bien. I think this uh, practice was super easy, right? And I hope you have practiced it, okay? Now, wait a second. Just let me see something here in the manual. What do we have? And it says that you have to do some... No, I think. That's it, because it says that we have to do a little bit of practice. We are going to do it. Just give me one second, because I want to explain you something else. So the last one and not the least, okay? El último eh, seguido, vea, de esto de should es cómo hacemos una pregunta con el should. Básicamente lo que hacemos es esto. So we have... Um, We have the should first, tenemos el should first y después tenemos el sujeto. Por ejemplo, should I drink Coca-Cola? Let's say Coca-Cola. And no, right? You can say yes, you should or no, you shouldn't, right? Ahora bien, cuando terminamos de decir no, you shouldn't, you should drink water. Right, because it's important to drink water. I do drink water, don't worry, I have my water here. <laughs> But I drink a lot of liquids. So what are you going to do right now? So basically, como ven, es el should al inicio, después el I, ¿por qué? Porque está solicitando un consejo, vea. Después el verbo y algo para complementar. And then you can answer yes, you should, or no, you shouldn't, okay? Y después, lo que vamos a realizar en estos momentos es que deben dar un consejo. Like, for example, let's try. Mr. Julio, should I run? Should I run? Yes, you should. <gasps> Why? <laughs> Now give me an advice. Ahora me tienes que dar un consejo. You should go to run. Uh -huh. Three times at least. Oh, really? At the week, mister? At the week. Ah, perfect. I will do it, mister. Thank you. What about you? Let's see. Miss Jennings, should I watch TV? Should I watch TV? Yes or no? Yes. Yes? yes you? Yes, no, me, 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 Salvarado. Should watch TV? Debería de ver TV? Yes or no? Yes. So sería yes, you? 
You should. Uh -huh. Yes, you should. Very good. And can you give me an advice? Me podrías dar un consejo de qué podría haber, por ejemplo, en la TV? Um, you should. What's, what's movies? Movies. Uh -huh. I would do it, Miss. Nice. Thank you. What about uh, Miss Clelia? Should I should I eat pupusas? Um, yes, you should. Show. Oh, oh, okay. And um, what what would be the flavor that I would I have to try, Miss? ¿Cuál sería el sabor que debería de de comer de las de las pupusas? Tell me. I should. You should. Recuerda que me estás dando un consejo. You should eat pupusas curtido mayonesa. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely, I would do it. <laughs> you should, uh -huh. you should pupusas and the chicken. Oh, delicious, Miss. I sh you should eat pu chicken pupusas, okay? Chicken, chicken pupusas. Delicious, Miss. Thank you. What about Crazy. you? Crazy I'm pupusa. I'm sorry? Crazy pupusa. Ah, okay. Can you give me the advice? The, the, pero tiene que darme el consejo, Mr. Si no, 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 it doesn't work it. <laughs> you should eat uh, crazy pupusa. Ah, you should eat the crazy pupusa. Excellent. Thank you, Mr. Okay, let's see, Miss uh, 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 Ana Veronica. Should I walk? In the streets. No, 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 no. In the in the streets, walk. I walk the street. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. sí, sí, camino. Sí, camino. Should I should I walk in the streets? Walk. Caminar en las calles. Uh huh. Huh? Should I do it? Should I? Yes, uh, yes, sure. you should. Okay. And any advice? Algún consejo que me dieras? Algún consejo. Mm -hmm. Ay, pero, eh, a ver. You should, shouldn't smoke for your health. No, pero de caminar, de caminar. Ah, de caminar. Uh -huh. You should, you should uh, work, uh, you should uh, work in Ilovas. I should work in El Vasco. Uh -huh, Why? Pero era de caminar. Uh, like for something for walk. At work. Ah, I should work at, I should walk at work. Debería de caminar en el work. Uh -huh. Maybe. Very good, Miss. Thank you. What about Carlos Miguel? Should I? Hello. Hello, should I drink, should I sleep, sorry, should I sleep 10 hours, 10 hours? Um, should I sleep 10 hours? No, 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 you should don't. You shouldn't. You shouldn't. Uh-huh, ¿cuál sería el consejo? What is the advice? Um, I should. You should I show sleep minimum eight or eight hours. Definitely right. You should sleep minimum eight hours, no more, right? Excellent, Mister. Thank you. Now here we have uh, the the practice for today's class homework number twelve. Ay, alguien me envió. I remember it was. Ah, no, pero ya les, ya les, ya les contesté, ¿verdad? I remember, I remember. They're going to. But here, we are going to give a voice, right? Vamos a dar un consejo. For example, number one, you shouldn't or should? Shouldn't. Shouldn't should smoke in bed. Number two, you should or shouldn't or should? Shouldn't. Cross the street at red traffic lights. Ah, pero con el tráfico en, en la luz verde, I mean, en la luz roja. No, sure. Yes, right. You? 
Sure. 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 Dice, ¿debes o no debes cruzarte en la calle cuando esté en la, ro en la luz roja? Sí. Depende si va a pie, sí. Ah, oh, definitely sí. right. That's a, pero creo que cruzar sería, ah, bueno, sí, vea, depende. Si sí, va en carro, ¿no? <laughs> good, good thought, good thought. Thank you. Let's see number three. That's a fantastic book. You, shh, yo creo que es sure, pero okay. Ajá, number three, number two, creo que es sure, pero okay. Vamos a ver después. Shouldn't or should? Number three. Should. 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 And number four, the doctor told him that he. Sure. Sure, eat less. He's too fat. Number five, he's 15. He shouldn't or should? Shouldn't. Shouldn't drive a car. Okay, let's see. Oh, very good. 20 points. Amazing. Okay, so these are the answers. Perfect job, you guys. You did awesome today. So, yeah. Do we have any questions so far? Or is it clear? Or no questions? Mm -hmm. Okay, I think we don't have any more questions, right? Okay, so uh, that will be all for today. Eso sería todo por el día de ahora. Thank you everybody for participating in today's class. Gracias a todos porque han participado. You did awesome. And I hope you continue like that. Espero continúen así. Traten por favor de estar presente. Ya solo nos queda esta semanita y la otra. Ya casi terminamos. Ya estamos más de allá que de acá. So let's try to do the practice and also the platform, okay? Questions, Mr. Carlos Miguel, were you going to say something? No, no question. Okay. So uh, if you don't have any questions, doubts, you may go. Have a good night and I'll see you tomorrow, everybody. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye. Good night, good everybody. Night. Take care. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you tomorrow. Take care. Bye. Bye. Bye, mister. Take care. Bye-bye. Have a good night.